Hi y'all, welcome back to my channel. Happy Muggy Wednesday. It's again 95 degrees out there. I'm starting to get very grumpy about that. I uh, thought I'd do another quick video. I uh, got a couple messages about people um, wanting me to do like these little, little reviews for the scrubs that I've gotten because I've gotten several scrubs and um, I'm just going to do a review on the second one today because I'm almost done with it. Um, the website or the company that I ordered this from is cocopink.net so it doesn't say anywhere on here oh yeah it does it's right here it says see it's coco pink it's called soft bubbles foaming sugar scrub so this is the only sugar scrub they sell it's six ounces and it retails for nine dollars okay us dollars um check out the website cocopink.net i didn't even hear of them until very recently several weeks ago one of the girls on my wax in one of my wax groups said it's a good place to get bath and body products they have room sprays, linen sprays, like hair products, lotions, sugar scrubs, and all sorts of stuff. So they have like a ton of different fragrances. And the reason that I ordered from them is because they carry my favorite scent in the whole world. This is in Henry Bendel's Vanilla Bean. Favorite fragrance of all time. So I got this in a room spray, and I got this in a sugar scrub, thinking that if I really liked the dupe, that I would get like body products and I really did so I'm gonna talk a little bit about this like I said it's six six ounces and um, it comes in this little container with a flip top it's really cute um, as you can see it's pink and I'm almost done with it I think I have enough for one more shower and this is actually it's gonna be a very conservative shower because I use a lot more than this um, but this is all I have left six ounces I got six washes out of this so it's not bad. One ounce of shower, pretty good. Um, it smells divine. If you don't know, if you've never smelled uh, Bendel's dupe, or uh, if you've never smelled Henry Bendel's vanilla bean, it is a really, really creamy vanilla um, blended with jasmine and patchouli. So it's a very heady scent. Um, I have this in candle form. If you burn this long enough, it smells like incense. Um, it's really, really good vanilla. So anybody out there who likes vanilla, like non-bakery vanilla, and you haven't tried this, I highly, highly recommend it. This is an awesome scent. It is beautiful. It is sexy. It's flirty. It's, ugh, I love it. This is a very good dupe, by the way. So I really enjoyed this. Um, so just a few things. If I was going to do a review about this, um, it is grainier than some of the other sugar scrubs I've used. The sugar crystals are larger, um, so it goes on a little rougher. I guess it's got more exfoliating properties than, say, like the bathing garden scrubs because they're softer. Um, so this is like a more coarse sugar scrub to me. Um, it still does leave my skin very, very silky. I love the way my skin feels. The only other thing that I complain about is that it's very drying. It is a clean rinsing scrub. Um, it does dry out my skin. I do have to use lotion and moisturizer because it leaves my skin like kind of papery dry. So if I was going to complain about two things, it would be that it's a little rough and it's a little drying. So... But definitely worth it for the fragrance. I love this scent, and I will order this again um, as soon as I'm done with my other arsenal of sugar scrubs that are coming in. So definitely this is on my reorder list. This is definitely a pickup for me again. So if you like a little coarser, you want more exfoliation, this is the way to go. The containers are cute. Price is decent. Um, shipping was real quick. Really, really like this company. Um, everything came really nice. So, cocopink.net, soft bubbles, foaming sugar scrub in, yeah, I just dropped this container. This is in Medell's Vanilla Bean. They have like a thousand different fragrances. Check them out, guys. This is really good. And I'll be sorry when it's, <laughs> I'll be sorry when it's finished. All right, that's it. So, y'all have a good day. I'll catch you again soon.